In an astonishing turn of events, unreleased information from behind the scenes has come to light, illuminating President Emerson Mnangagwa's apparent anxiety regarding the Harare vote during the recent elections in Zimbabwe. Insiders claim that Mnangagwa frequently inquired with authorities about the status of the vote counting in Harare, demonstrating his concern about the result. With 907,700 registered voters in the Harare district and 176. 000 in the Chitungwiza district, the Harare Metropolitan Province, home to about 1,578,000 people, is a formidable electoral force. The opposition party, formerly known as the MBC and now called as the Citizens Coalition for Change, has historically held strongholds in Mutare and other metropolitan areas, while the incumbent party, ZANU PF, has had difficulty gaining support. Voters in Harare were aggravated on election day by delays in the opening of polling places brought on by the late delivery of election supplies. Tensions increased when some people were unable to exercise their democratic right to vote. It was during this turbulent time that President Mnangagwa's anxiety started to show. According to sources close to the president, Mnangagwa constantly requested updates on the status of the vote count in Harare and showed symptoms of uneasiness. He sought confirmation from senior officials about the veracity of the material he had been given because he was especially worried about his performance in the capital city. Mnangagwa consulted constituency experts from Forever Associates Zimbabwe to examine the scenario in several areas FAS. FAS, defined as a recognized private voluntary organization and headed by former Brigadier General Walter Tapfumaniai is said to have connections to the Central Intelligence Organization CIO. These experts offered sincere evaluations from their different positions and offered significant insights that impacted Umingagwa's overall vote share. At the CIO's main office, the Shamanuka building, votes were consolidated. Military intelligence also carried out its own vote consolidation, and Umingagwa continuously received reports from the voting places. Compared to the CIO's forecasts, it expected Umingagwa would receive a bigger proportion of the vote. The Joint Operations Command's presence, which is made up of senior leaders from different security agencies, serves as additional proof of the importance placed on the electoral process. In Zimbabwe, rumors and worries have been raised in response to Umingagwa's concerns about the vote in Harare. Opponents claim that these fears coming from behind the scenes are a sign of possible electoral fraud and a loss of confidence inside the ruling party. Such revelations raise concerns about the legitimacy and long-term stability of the government, as well as the validity of the electoral process.